Hey everybody, Mazer here, and uh, we're doing a requested update for the 8-BitDo wireless receiver. Uh, it came to my attention that the 8-BitDo uh, retro receiver, this one right here, did not allow the Pro Controller to be connected to your computer. So what we're going to do is we are going to do that right now. So you go to the website, support8 bitdocom you go down to the product right here and we are going to open it up and we're going to make a little folder and drop it into the folder here perfect okay so we'll drop it in here extract we're all good and we're going to go for the update insert retro receiver Hold down the pair button of the receiver and connect to PC use versus uh, via a USB cable. So we are going to do that right now and we'll be right back after it's connected. So we just connected it using a USB extension cable that I have and we held down the pairing button while we connected it and as you can see it has seen the version so we're going to click update and it should not take that long at all. Uh, we are going to look for, let's see here, the file type that we're, that we need. So we go to new folder 2 right here. Here's the DAT file. Um, new version is 1.14. That's what we want. And then it should, yep, there we go. It starts updating. Okay, and we are back, and the update has been installed. We're all good to go. So the next thing we're going to do is plug this in, get my... Eight, <laughs> we're going to plug this in, get the Pro Controller, and we're going to see if it syncs up. So we'll be right back one more time. Okay, so we are back, and I'm holding my uh, Nintendo Switch Pro Controller. Uh, right now, so we're going to hit this sync button on the adapter on the computer. It's blinking, so we're going to hold, hit the sync button here and pair. Oh, it looks like they are linked. So let's go to properties, and there you have it. It's working. The Wii, and I'm sorry, I keep saying it. The Switch Pro controller is now compatible with the 8 bit though wireless retro adapter. I'm using 100% um, functional for the computer. Look at that. Isn't that amazing? It's like it does what it's advertised to do. That is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Uh, so there you have it. The newest update 1.14 is live. It's super easy to install. You just have to connect the adapter to the computer through a uh, USB cable. Uh, USB extension cables is what I use, so that should be pretty easy. After the update, all you got to do is hit the sync button on the controller and on the adapter. And look at that. It happened immediately. Perfect compatibility. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. The update for the retro USB adapter and the instructions on how to update it. So thank you very much. I am Mazer, and I will see you all next time. Bye. Hey everyone, Mazer here, and I just want to thank you for watching my video. Please remember to like and subscribe. Your support means the world to me.